Playing football is one thing, but charming almost every fan out there is something entirely different. And then we have Neymar, who does both with ease, which is why we are all eager to know what he's up to off the pitch. Let's dive into Neymar Jr.'s crazy lifestyle, his relationships, his son, musical career, and media adventures. Neymar da Silva Santos Jr. was born on the 5th of February 1992 in Mogi das Cruzes, a low socioeconomic area in Sao Paulo. His father, Neymar Santos Sr., was a former footballer who had a massive influence on him while growing up. Together with his mother Nadine, they had to take on multiple jobs to sustain the family. Four years after Neymar was born, his baby sister Rafaela was welcomed into the family. In the poverty-stricken childhood, Neymar found interest in street football, which helped him to develop his skills. When he was 11, his family moved to São Vicente. Neymar would start playing football for their youth side Portuguesa Santista, a professional football club in Santos, as he looked to emulate his idol, Robinho. At 17, he had earned his first professional contract and sponsorship deal, and here's what his career has turned out to be so far. Now 30 years old, Neymar is a versatile player who can thrive as a striker, winger, and a number 10. Back in 2003, Neymar joined Santos' youth system. Although he had a trial with Madrid in 2004, his father insisted that he remained at Santos to fully develop his talent. By March 2009, Neymar made his professional debut at 17. For the next four years, he would achieve tremendous success individually and at club level. In June 2013, Neymar moved to Barcelona for a fee of 86 million and in his four seasons with the club, he scored over 100 goals and won eight trophies, including the 2015 treble, but things changed. The former Santos man sealed a move to PSG for a record 222 million, making him the most expensive player in history. Although he has won a dozen trophies and scored over a century of goals, his time at PSG has seen mixed results with injuries playing a large role. For country, Neymar has been the talisman for Brazil since making his debut in 2010, even though he has yet to win a major trophy with the Seleção. But let's get outside football. Neymar has a son, Davy Luca, who was born in 2011 with his ex, Carolina Danta. Being a well-known playboy, he has found himself in a couple of relationships. He also dated Natalia Barulik, a American model, singer, dancer, and DJ. His most recent girlfriend was Bruna Biancardi, whom he got engaged to in January last year but broke up with in August. Neymar dated actress Bruna Marquezina for six years from 2012 to 2018 and was once linked to UFC Octagon girl Jenny Andrade. Currently, he is rumored to be with Jessica Torini, a 30-year-old digital influencer and model. Neymar maintains a close relationship with his family even though his parents split in 2016. He wakes up before 7 a.m. to work out. The player's sessions involve strength building and some flexibility exercises. He also loves boxing, yoga, tennis, and hiking, which he does in his spare time. By 10 p.m., he's already in bed. Neymar revealed that he loves to play adventure games and go to the cinema. He's an avid Christian and has worn headbands with the words 100% Jesus, and on his IG page, you will find a Bible verse in his bio. But let's take a break from his lifestyle and look at some of his properties. Only a handful of footballers can boast of anything close to what Neymar has. He had a yacht that cost around $8 million, which he named after his mother, and a private jet of Phenom 100 made by Embraer with his initials NJR, but the properties were seized by a Brazilian court over allegations of tax evasion. The Brazilian has a private aircraft which is managed by his agency, Sport E Marketing. The plane is worth at least $17.5 million and was bought in 2016. And then there is the Airbus H145, a 13 million personal helicopter. It is a four-ton twin-engine rotorcraft which can carry up to 10 passengers and two pilots. Moving over to cars, we might have a hard time recounting everything he has in his possession. Starting with the highlight of his garage is the Ferrari 458 Italia, which costs over 200000 Only a few other celebs own this automobile artwork. It is powered by a 4.5-liter V8 engine and has a top speed of 337 kilometers an hour. It is his favorite vehicle. Neymar also has a Maserati MC12 that comes in blue and white colors with a top speed of over 330 kilometers an hour. And then there are three Audis, the white R8 Spider, an RS7, and a Q7. He is also believed to own one of the fastest cars in the world, the Lycan Hypersport that has a top speed of around 355 kilometers an hour. Another supercar that is sitting pretty in his garage 
is the Lamborghini Veneno, which boasts a 6.5-liter V12 engine. The limited edition Roadster was originally priced at $4.5 million. Neymar bought a mansion in Brazil for $3.25 million. The property is said to have seven bedrooms, a large swimming pool, a squash court, a cocktail bar, a panoramic lift between floors, and a 20-car garage. The building has a glass facade and is located on the Alphaville near Sao Paulo within a gated residential area. But that is not the only property he owns in Brazil. The PSG star also owns a six-bedroom mansion that occupies over 10,000 square meters near Rio de Janeiro, and it is fitted with luxurious facilities such as a massage room, a spa, a sauna, a heated jacuzzi, tennis court, large gym, and an underground cellar. Back in 2012, he gifted the mother of his child a penthouse worth $1 million. The star player also has a mansion in Beverly Hills, California that occupies 2,000 square feet. The property has seven bedrooms, a home theater, multiple tennis courts, a swimming pool, and a wine cellar. Neymar recently lived in a five-story house worth $7.7 million as a tenant in Paris. Being one of the most stylish footballers, Neymar has tattoos all over his body. They are probably more than 40 in number. He has his mother's face tattooed on his biceps, a prayer on his right chest, his sister's face on his arm, and then there are love, crown, lion face, blessed bird, diamond, cross, tiger, dream chaser, prayers, trophies, football, his son's face, Mickey Mouse, superheroes, name anything, this dude probably has it on his skin. You already know what the player spends his money on, but do you have an idea of his net worth? Neymar is one of the richest footballers in the world. He earned about $95 million last year, according to Forbes' list of the highest paid athletes of 2022. His average salary at PSG, tons of endorsements, sponsorships, and social media presence add up to give him the wealth that he has. Back in 2018, he was seen as the world's most branded footballer with over 35 endorsements that included the likes of Puma, Red Bull, Qatar National Bank, and Beats. Neymar earns over 600,000 euros weekly at PSG with add-ons from performance-related bonuses. We expect his net worth to be over 200 million. Despite leading a lavish lifestyle, Neymar doesn't forget to help those in need. He has a charitable organization, Instituto Progetto Neymar Jr. Impressively, he also donates 10% of his yearly earnings back to his church in Brazil. The Brazilian once helped Vanspor, a second-tier struggling Turkish side, with about 20,000 to relieve them of their financial burdens. Neymar organizes charity events every year and has also worked with organizations such as Global Goals, Quicksilver Foundation, and UNICEF to help those in need. Being one of the most famous soccer players in the world hasn't stopped Neymar from getting into controversies. He has been accused of the most heinous crimes, racist comments, rape, fraud, financial corruption, and tax evasion in the past, but most, if not all, the prosecutors have dropped the criminal charges. Fun fact, if Neymar wasn't a soccer player, he'd probably be a musician or movie star. This guy has become an icon in promoting Brazilian modern pop music. He has performed some of his dance antics to celebrate his goals, and then he has featured in more than seven films. Another one, he has a best friend named Gustavo Almeida. Gustavo was his teammate when Neymar was on the childhood futsal team. He's currently employed in one of Neymar's family companies. Finally, we have his social media presence, over 200 million on IG alone, close to 100 on Facebook, more than half of that number on Twitter, and millions of subscribers on YouTube. What a player! Would you back him to return to being a potential Ballon d'Or winner once again?